All right, we're here at 1665 Brayburn Road here in uh, Altadena. Now, we're running our camera from a three-inch clean now located on the left-hand side of the house by the air conditioning unit. This is the only clean out available to us. Yeah. So, but Alex, you had a look underneath the house. Saw you did ABS. see some ABS plastic, but we see it tying into a cast iron pipe in the bedroom in the front that was, which we'll, we'll have a look on the camera was very badly connected, right? Yes. Uh, anyway, we're here to check the main line. We obviously cannot check every pipe in the house. We'll have the general inspector crawl underneath. He's going to do a more physical inspection. Right now, we have our camera in. Now, this, the, the numbers, the footage is not correct. Uh, it's, it's a little more than that, but you'll see as we come you back. Zero it out. You are. Why don't we zero it out now? We're going to zero that, that. Okay. So, we're actually at the city connection right now. You can see it dives down into the city there. Kind of dives down, turning over here, and then let's just see. Because it goes into a lot of water over here. This is not very good over here. Let's push it forward, Alex. Push it forward. Push it forward. Just before the dive. Well, it kind of, you think that's really diving? It's kind turning. of turning, eh? So let me pause the recording. I'm going to locate this over here. Okay. Okay, we located this approximately about eight feet deep right before the turn into the city sewer. And as we come back, you're going to see there's going to be some standing water here. This is all standing. And then we come out. It's not too bad, Farrell. Okay, let me just pause the Okay, so look, we, we pulled the camera out because we had a dirty lens. So we're just going to... Uh, you got to, you shouldn't have zero. Okay, zero it again. We're like 130 feet. So what we're going to do is we're going to just run the camera in from this clean out because uh, it dirties the lens and it's difficult to see. Nevertheless, in the street, it definitely was a little flat. Um, there's no doubt about it because before the sewer line dives, it's like two feet deep out of the city connection. It's like eight feet deep. So it's a little flat in the street. Go quickly, Alex. Right there. We see we have ABS plastic, and what it does, it takes several turns, and it goes underneath the house, where this all looks good over here. And this, you can physically see this. This all looks good over here. You can see the fittings along the way. And right now we're coming to that piece of cast iron pipe which is very badly dislocated underneath the house, eh? And you can see that, eh? Yeah. Comes to the ABS plastic. This section of, of cast iron pipe is very old. And what it does, it goes underneath the front bathroom over here, probably into the ground. It's very old, this piece of pipe. <clears throat> I mean, it is functioning, but it's old. And it was left, it was left. So somebody replaced the line. We see this so often there, they leave looks like a little bit of, a little bit of roots, roots coming, coming in. Really this cast iron pipe should be replaced. It comes to the outside of the house where it goes to a PVC pipe, makes a couple of turns over here, funky turns over there, and I believe we did see some roots the first time we were there, right? <clears throat> so this should be replaced, all of that there. Then it goes to a PVC pipe running through the front yard, which actually is in good condition. Might be a clean yeah, I saw that. Okay, but let's keep going. See, this all looks good. So definitely that cast iron pipe underneath the house to the outside should be replaced and a clean out should be repair, uh, installed outside. And definitely those 245s need to be taken out, the first 245s, because um, they have roots getting into it. <coughs> So this all looks good here. Now right over here, the pipe is two feet deep. And what it's going to do, it's going to dive down. Dive down. And then it's going to keep going down. You see it dives down to about eight feet deep over here. And this is where the six-inch clay pipe 
runs into the street. What we'll do, you see, we do we go into a bit of water, keep going out, <coughs> runs Be into a bit of water. Enough. Okay, yeah, keep going. See, we're in water, so there is standing water in the street, but what we'll do, okay, yeah. there is the city connection right there. I'm going to pause the recording, we're going to wait for the water to disappear, and then we'll see how much water is standing in that line. Okay, now let's go ahead and pull the camera back. We measured the grade in the street and it's very flat, but coming back, okay, from here, you see, you see, it, it, it is flat. There's no grade in the street and there's no reason why that should be because you, you're you very shallow inside of the property. So this is it's not very good then. Okay, we're going to pull the camera back. Uh, we've pretty much seen everything right now. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and stop the recording over here.